Shotgun questions, random questions that I get from from the people. Yes, from the people. Um, so with me we have Juan Carlos Ramirez Jr. Juan is in there. And <laughs> that shit not even a horn. <laughs> Hell no, that's a fucking that? that's a tong. Like, <laughs> I can't even fucking. Charles and Dolls. Tong was ass. Yes, right? Like the last little fucking thing I tried to do, the, the Irish Indian guy. Yeah, that shit was, that was horrible. He made Gupta the Leprechaun. Like, what the fuck was that? Okay, <laughs> so first question is: Do you think that there's a black man in America that has not experienced racism? Yes. Yep. Who? 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 Please. I who? What black man in America who? hasn't experienced who? racism? Hasn't. Who? Yes. Who? A black man who's never left the black community at any point in time. Or a black person that's been raised around white people that didn't realize he was being... No, 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 that, no, that, per, no, that person... See, I, I was going to think that, but the fact of the matter is I know some black people like that who didn't really meet other black people until about college. Yeah. And the thing is that they didn't realize the racist shit that happened to them until some... No, that's what I'm race, saying. Right? Like, they, yeah, they, they, they don't they, know. No, but they experienced racism, not that they were aware of the mm-hmm. racism. But if you have black people who live in the black community, if they've never had an altercation with the police, they wouldn't have... They would have never experienced racism because everybody treated them like shit in the first place. Yep. Okay, uh, they grew up around me in the area and the type of place I grew up at in the South. You think there's a black person in the South that has not... That was not the question. I, I, you well, said a black sorry. person in America. Oops. So I've answered your question. America. You said America. Right. You now said black person in America. Person in the South? No, they've all experienced racism. Thank you. Just the mere fact that... So, sorry, sorry. Just sorry. the mere fact that the location that they are in, right, would be a, a part, of the re- part of the racism that actually happened because there are only limited areas that black people can be in the South. Sundown mm-hmm. towns, anyone? Yeah, if anybody, <laughs> I'm drinking right now. If, so if anybody uh, down south said that they have not experienced it, they must got lucky. I wrote or down. they're high as shit. I wrote that down as a fucking joke because I'm like, are you see? When I heard it said, I was like, oh, are uh, you stupid? Like nigga, you was uh, went to high school. Where I went to high school at. Oh, I'm, I'm serious. Uh, I, I, um, you might be lucky, Calvin. Sounds like their education was terrible. Um, yeah, <laughs> that was fucked up. <laughs> that was real fucked up. Um, uh, racist jokes. How far is too far? It depends on the person listening. Exactly. It, it really depends on the audience. I think anyone should be allowed to to take comedy as far as it can go. If they're willing to crack on everybody, and, that, and, that, and that's what truth. it is, right? Especially, yeah, that's true. When it's truthful as well, but I think that's that's part of the comedic the com- the comedian skill. It's just that you know, if you're a white person cracking on black people and only black people, that's when it can be like, nigga, what? <laughs> but if you're cracking on white people, black people, Asians, whatever, like just everybody getting it, and you're cracking it based off of your life experience, and I think that's what a lot of people don't understand is that. Some people really do come across the stereotype of your race, yes. and that's all they come across. Yes. So sorry if that's the perception that they've they've gotten, or that's the perception that and they have for their material. But mm-hmm. speak to your own, baby. Like I was watching, uh, I was watching stand up. <laughs> yeah. And one one of the stand ups was like, "Where's my white my white people in the audience?" Right when he said that, I was like, "Here we go again." But he changed it. He changed it around. He was like, "Okay, I just want to know where y'all at." Don't leave your cell phones and go to the bathroom because the black person next to you going to act like he never seen it. I yep. was dying. I, he's black. To, uh, he was a black comedian, but he was telling the truth, and that's what makes it a little funnier. Because you, you can't like, help, hell it. Yeah, hell can't yeah. help but think, like, as a black person, you know what I'm saying, motherfucker do be thinking that shit. Yeah, yeah. I'll be thinking it about myself one day. Yeah, so, yeah. And then I like, seen a white comedian who was like, 
hey, uh, where's my white people at? And they were like, yay! <laughs> he was like, I, right, you got a suit on, so I'm definitely talking to you. You know about stocks. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it, it works out in those sense of the ways if, if you doing it with truth. Ah, oh, look, 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 who coming into his house right here right who now? Who the fuck is that? Huh? Look, look, look. Then he want to record it. He look, coming in like an FBI agent. Yeah, Dead these, celebrity. These are, these are the guys that uh, be talking mad crap. Yeah, like, yo. <laughs> that's weird as hell. He coming in here with the camera. Yeah, he coming in here with the, with the camera. Oh, That's not Uh-oh. fair. He coming in here with the camera and all. I'm like, worried you know about what I'm my vanity. You can't do that. He didn't get his hair did. He didn't get his hair did? I didn't get my head did. Oh, that's why he was blocking in the camera? Uh, oh, true, shit. true. I forgot about that. Um, <laughs> yeah, when, when is our live? Next week, right? Who? Yep. On our 100 episode? Yep. Episode. Oh, yeah, we're 99 right now. Next week. Dead celebrity jokes. Dead celebrity jokes? Yes. How soon is too soon, and are they worth the fucking rest? How soon? When you're in the funeral. <laughs> no. <laughs> to the person that, making You can't say a joke on a celebrity where he's in the funeral right there. You know, that's too uh, soon. That's too soon. Like seriously, like are, are, talking about are they even, the machine goes Doop! and you make a joke. Are they even <laughs> worth the risk <laughs> of making the the, the, the joke? Because a lot of people get in trouble for them, and I'm not saying this. And you know, again, is the person that's listening to me funny? is funny. You know, I don't take it to the heart. You can say a joke that's not even all that offensive, but if someone finds it offensive, Fancy? now it's an offensive. That's that's the issue with this generation that they're offended by stuff that shouldn't be offensive. It's like they've never had friends before. Like Dave Chappelle said, you got to watch out for the L's and the <laughs> and the G's and exactly. the D's and the T's. And next, you know, he got he got <laughs> he got critics for that. No, come I mean, on. It's the fucking truth, though. You, I mean, you can't, we're like, you can't the other time when I when I on my show I was like all oh, to the, the LGB and A to Z whatever y'all are people was like oh that's not fair you shouldn't not say that what shut up <laughs> I mean it's their mom so you know how they go you be like, please every every month is their mom yeah but you don't have no Facts. problem no 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 lie though you would say like June is their month right so why yeah. are they fighting the Irish to get in their parade yeah I don't know are you celebrating being Irish or are you celebrating being you know they, they want to be in everything persuasion. Yeah, there, there's a whole thing with the Irish Day Parade, like with the St. Patrick's Day Parade, where they were like, why can't we have our gay trucks in your parade? Because we're gay and Irish. It's about celebrating being Irish. Irish it's about not celebrating gay. St. Patrick's Day. It has nothing to do with your sexuality. Yeah. Now, you know, now I was talking the last episode crazy. about that. crazy. Well, in, in other words, like let's say if you are gay and you like to dress all flamboyant and all that, this just, is not the just, parade for it. But even, no, but even if it is, just make sure it's green. That's it. <laughs> That's it. it. It's about you being yeah, Irish, right, not about you, you being. You gotta rock your fucking rainbow there. I see what you mean. Like, yeah, like, but don't they want up the whole color you scheme. You want to wear a crop top and you Listen. a nigga wear a crop top and you a nigga. Let's make it green a- and celebrate your Irishness. Like that's how I feel. A to Z is turning into the same thing with the woman um um empowerment thing. They want to be in everything. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Jesus, I speak the way it speak. You know? What I'm... Yo, I can't. Jesus Christ. They won't be in everything. Why is not for us? Because it's not for you. Shut it up See, and go over there. Y'all notice they gave black people their parade in the cold ass month because they know we won't get out there. Yeah. <laughs> right? You know, that's why we all go ham at the Caribbean Day one because it's just like, fuck it. I ain't even from the island, but niggas out. Fuck it. Fuck it. <laughs> Shit. Yo, that day on the Caribbean parade, That's I'm funny. Caribbean. You didn't see these girls the way they be dressing? Nigga, I'll be in the background Rico. talking about You are Caribbean. <laughs> Shit. No, I'll be like, I'm from the island island. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Just to be in the parade see, with this, them. This nigga trying like, to be like, I want to be in the parade with them. He get two parades. He Puerto Rican. They got their own parade. And they're in the Caribbean. Hey, they get listen, another parade. whatever gets me out the job and I get paid. Facts. <laughs> I'll be Irish for that day too. Hey, look at the man. He's like, I like corned beef. And potatoes. potatoes. Let's do this. No tartar sauce. No tartar sauce, though. No. <laughs> <laughs> tartar sauce again. Tartar sauce. Tartar sauce. Oh, tartar sauce. Tartar sauce. Oh, man. I should have never bought that shit. Yo, you never, you never should have. I was about to give him tartar sauce for his fried chicken at Popeye's. <laughs> my daughter, no. <laughs> my daughter's, my daughter's chicken. T- you gotta, they you gotta you listen to the other episodes you to understand. Went to Popeyes and picked up the food. I they smoked. gave you, you the, tartar the tartar sauce. sauce. I smoke weed, so I have an excuse <laughs> to not remember. To not I remember. Facts. But that's why you got us for. <laughs> there you go. I'll have some sort of excuse. Like, it, yeah. Um, You're like, I'll forget, but XY101 would never let me forget. Record, son. <laughs> My sister asked me this shit and it threw me way the fuck off. <laughs> What's the whitest boy's name? 
you know. Topic. Timothy. <laughs> Yo, Jake. can I Jake. say it? Jake. <laughs> I just said, t- and he said Timothy. <laughs> like, he beat me to it. <laughs> Timothy? Yeah. <laughs> like th- I said Jake. Jake? Jake, yeah. I, I don't know what From he's, State Farms? No, no. No. I just, <laughs> no. no. Damn. That fucks it up though, because I mean, it kind of gives it like yeah. a lead. You know, yeah, like, yeah. That, like, it gives it, it gives, gives it like a lead. Like, saying, like, no, no, but it. Timothy. What is it, what's the name that white people have that you don't know anybody else having? That's what I'm saying. Like Timothy. I mean, when you think of Timothy, you think of Tim Turner. Yeah. Right now, granted, like Jake, I, I heard uh, black, or, and I even heard a Spanish person with Jake. You know really? what I'm saying? So yeah. I thought that was pretty white. Yeah. That's how a man is white to me. What about Hunter? Nah, Tim is Hunter? a man is. Nah. Hunter? Oh, you know what's funny? I only hear it on white people, but the name has too much flavor to just be a white name. <laughs> yeah. What up, Brock? Brock? Brock. Lesnar, yeah. No, but Brock sounds to me Actually, like a what? black name. That, no, th- that's a black last name. I know a guy. You know why? Yeah. Because what? ain't 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 we just give names. We just give names. What you gonna name your son today? Wait, let me see. Let me read here. You know what I'm saying? They just give a name to a kid. No, but I, I know <laughs> I know a black guy whose last name is Brock is Brock. It's a family name. But so, your first yeah. name? Like Brock. Right? Yeah, Brock. Like Brock. No, no, like You Callum. want Super Brock or... or oh, I'm sorry, not you. Not Cap? you, Brock. You can sit down. Callum, like one of my... Uh, Callum, yes. That is a very Irish name. That's my godfather's... I'm, my godfather. What was it? Godson. My godson's... Uh, yeah, Callum, that's... Yeah. His Cal- name is Callum. That's a, you, you'll hear that name a lot from people in the UK. Yeah. Callum. Uh, I mean, what's a really Scottish name? I can't really think of anything. Scottish? Yeah. So like my name is my name is a is a white name by origin, but it's now yeah. no longer a white only name. What about Carome or Candome, something like that? Dude, that's a black name, Carome. I got you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, he even said it, Carome, and then he think about it. Yeah, yeah, that shit is black. That, an asshole. <laughs> I do. that goes down with BMW and stuff. It's like the yeah. the most simplest names because the thing about it is like so like it's easy to know a white last name because normally it's a job. <laughs> No, no, oh, no, no. Or is their first no, name? That's facts, no, though. No, no, no. It's no, funny, no, but it's no, facts. No. Or Western is their Europe, first it's name? It's funny, but it's facts. No, no, Western European names are usually like your last name, your family name. Why you have like a blacksmith is actually a white person name. Yeah, yeah. Instead of, instead of a black, like a you know black or whatever, it's because your last name was like your family trade. So mm-hmm. you're like I'm Timothy of the house of whatever that sort of shit. Yeah. So black, you know, black cobbler. Mm-hmm. Or cobs or anything variations of them is the they just changed they started changing the name cutting it yeah. down right I mean there. I love the Rivera just means that you're you're someone who from Spain who lived by a river <laughs> that's what Rivera means you're mm-hmm. of the river like not even the same damn river you're just like by my some la- water la- that runs my last so, name oh your name is Rivera my last so name is, is mountain my, mountain yeah that's La Loma black name. La Loma means mountain they're from King. the mountains, mountainous region of Spain yeah so I told that's you where I got my from. goddamn last name. Huh? I told you I got my goddamn last name. I from your mother. Last name younger. Tote. Tote? How could he get a last name from his mama? I mean, from his father. Well, some of the fathers don't be giving the last name. They don't want to get caught. That's why. <laughs> that's actually unless, valid. Unless. Unless. He said, he said nah, unless. if you don't got your daddy's last name, you're nah, a bastard. You ain't putting my last name into that test come. Or, <laughs> I can't. Or, 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 or not in my situation at all, but in some southern households, the mother and father are brother and sister. No, but Tote, where it came from? That sounds very southern. It does. Thank you. Uh, um, kissing cousins. Mm-hmm. Kissing brothers and sisters. Oh, the you that. South is known for kissing cousins. Kissing cousins. Right. They don't say brothers and sisters because that's just a little too. Cause it, that's just nasty. Yo. That's why. They do it. Hey, they they do yo. it. Yeah, yeah. But they say hey, kissing yo. cousins. Remember, it sounds actually, a little more. Actually, actually, that's more prevalent in fucking European societies and shit like that. Well, that's because that's how you bred royalty. Mm-hmm. That's why they have the Ginsburg Well, according, according they, they, to, that, to that, that. man, mm-hmm. according to the man-made book, it's been going on since, uh, you know, Adam and Eve started. Word, like you really thought they fucked the ten thousand people who never fucked each other, right? Exactly. How do you think the world started? Look at his. Fa- <laughs> you start from two people. Where the other people came from? Just, just the other day, just the other day, I had to explain because they had, they I made said, four and Christian, those four. Had damn, to fuck each other. we really like, getting especially deep. Especially if you're a Christian, you have to realize that everyone that you yourself have ever fucked is somehow your cousin. I can't believe we're getting deep. We really getting deep. That's yeah. what we do. Shh. And, and then they said the jokes about pussy. Then they said the show works. Then they said you can't do that because it's against the heaven law. Yeah, because you make too many people doing well, each actually, other. Religious law, not heaven law. Religious. Yeah, whichever one. Because we don't even know the real heaven law. You know what I'm saying? Oh, cool. We know that. I'm, I'm just telling the truth. Is it a gate there? Somebody come back and tell me. No. Nah. As long as they got weed there. Right? Is there a weed spot there? You don't know. Like- 
they're above the clouds. Hey, plants, you're the one that's sending the clouds plants, up there. Greens, <laughs> I want to go to the nature. Right, I, I that's know. a good answer, right? If you so that means the we smoke go down. Yeah, I, <laughs> I want to bring the weed with me, like it, I don't know. I make it make My sense. He's like, yo, listen, I didn't smoke that much right now. Put it in the tomb. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> yes, bury me with it. If I come bury me now. with it. So be on some remember the time type of shit. Yeah, yeah. There you go. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> do you remember the time? Yeah, you know what I mean? Goddamn right, I do shit. <laughs> Smoke a dust joint. Oh no, dust joint. That's bad. That's actually a thing. What? Got a dust joint. Fucking uh, dip. The dip. PCP. You dip cigarettes oh. in PCP or blunt in PCP. And uh, oh, oh, you put it in high, Excuse me. And you smoke it. It's called dip. What about CBD? What the shit? Oh, why? What? <laughs> no. Like, wait, wait. Did I hear him say seaweed? Did you say seaweed? <laughs> And this is another episode of CBD. Why 101. He said CBD, CBD. Why? What? He was like, nigga, I'm all THC, nigga. I mean, like that, but yeah, like, like, what? He's like, this this does not compute for me. What is this weak shit for? Yeah, like. It's legal. So much shit now. Yeah, like, if you, if you want to. Fucking try CBD and see what kind of effect. Go to that fake ass weed store in the middle of Manhattan. Oh, weed. Those, those stupid cars. Yeah, Weed yeah. World. You want? I don't. I don't even know if that's real CBD. I don't know what the fuck that is, but it's something. I, it's something. <laughs> and people like weed is CBD and THC. So you can sell weed and a little bit of TLC. CBD, you can sell CBD as weed. No one knows any fucking better. Now, now he's starting to sound like the LGBT. It's a little of a TLC I mean, with the LGBs just... and the C. You know what I'm saying? It was military. They don't got time for that's shit. How Everything's that shit abbreviated. Works. I mean, you watch people go in there like, yo, I'm going to get fucked up. And it's like, no, you're not, my nigga. No, you're not. <laughs> it's just, it says we not, will, but shit, I mean. Not with that water down. <laughs> so, um, oh, why have we turned crimes committed into entertainment? That's the only thing I mean, it's social media. What you expect? I mean, like, why is it so fucking it? Like, we have nothing else to do. But you Basically. gotta, but you gotta understand that we respond to negative things like a more, motherfucker. Mo- more than positive. I don't know why. Like, like, if like you see how, like, let's really talk about it. Like, you know, um, what's that girl with the uh? She gorilla glued her hair. I think. Yeah, oh, yeah. That, that was pathetic. <laughs> <laughs> and it was then, stupid. and wow. then she she gorilla glued her hair. Wow. Then after she made a GoFundMe page, and made mad money, Matt made like how much she made in her GoFundMe page? Like I mean, it, I it was it was a it was a, it was a saw the number and saw more than three digits and got pissed. Yep. <laughs> I, I would too. That, that was it. I, you know? I would too. Not only that, she and got, then she tried to sue the um Gorilla Glue company, and they just looked at her like really. You know we put it on and she got her her joint for free. Yeah, they they gave her um uh. I'm like fix yo, her hair and everything. They, so she was this, trying to put like glue her track in. I'm track. like yo, this is what we do for so clout. Dumb shit. She was trying to put it on her hair. Put it like this. This, this is what we do for clout. Like, but put it like this. If I come to you and be like, hey, Why uh, like, like, you know, because she was, because she was stupid. Baby hairs. Yeah, that's what I, right. And she so wanted she to keep a style for a a little bit. Yep. Bugged out. No, no, but is she the stupid one or the other person that went right behind her? Both. No, the other person behind her was trying to get that money too. Yeah, yes. that's what I'm saying. So who's Dude, the dumbest one? You want to get the some one behind that. her because she thought people were gonna pay twice for the bullshit. They were like, no. They said you it. saw what happened. They only talked about. They only talked about her tw- two days. That's it. <laughs> she didn't you, even get I talked mean, about. Like, like you want some shit to hold your fucking hair? I got some shit at the crib. Listen, hold it down. She, 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 she must have somebody to nothing. She must have not seen American Pie. Facts. <laughs> yes. You want yes. to hold your hair down. Yes. Wait, 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 there you wait, go. Wait, wait, that was a, that wait. Was, that was you something. can't blame any black person for oh, yeah, not yeah, seeing yeah, yeah, that's American true, Pie. That's true. That's true. That's true. That's true. Especially in Almost this every black person saw American not Pie. Not in this generation. Every black person saw Band Camp. Mm. And one time at Band Camp? Yeah. I mean. Yeah. Yep. The Same. first the first American pie was not popular amongst our community. It wasn't until like the third or fourth that people were like, yo, this shit kind of funny. That's why they kept doing it, because they were like, yo, this shit shouldn't even keep going. But yeah, like, yeah. Isn't it the same as like every white person saw white chicks? 
Be- yeah. Because wait, wait. You can you can definitely blame a white person for not seeing something black. Okay. But you can't blame black for seeing something white. It's like, it's like yeah. when you hear a black person hasn't watched Friends, you're like, oh, okay, I get it. You watched Living Single. I got you. But, yeah, I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> but if a, if a white person doesn't see some shit, you're like, come on. Y'all know y'all always on our shit. How'd you not see this? Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, idiots. Oh, man. Yo, I, we can go on and on about that topic, what you bringing up. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Absolutely. Look at our world star. World star. No, I got no. it from fucking <laughs> No, but like, like I was going to say. If I come to you and say, hey, uh, got good news. What happened? I just opened my new business. Oh, great. You see how boring it sounds? Yo, I got some news. What happened? Look, f- first of all, let me talk about this guy I came up. Now you got a whole story <laughs> of how you beat this guy's butt down. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? The wind was blowing like it was 1963. The place. It was New York. You know what I'm saying? Like, you well, already have. But that's a storyteller, right? But, a, a story but that's teller- what I'm saying. It's more entertainment. But how are you going to tell a story about. Facts. That you open a business. No, no, that's just that is just facts. No, that's not what I'm saying. That's you that's why know. it's more entertainment. No, that's not what it you is. Know? Because if the, if you tell somebody the same thing, right? Like, okay, so yeah, so oh, guess what? I just started a new business. All right, cool. Like that's yeah. that's your. They don't. Charge, they right? probably won't it's even like, ask yo, you what it is. Let me tell you some shit. So remember, <laughs> I had that idea a long time ago about blah, blah, blah. So then I started talking to this person, and then that person. Was like, yeah. Oh, this kind of cool. And then so now I got this whole new joint. Oh, word. You that's why? your reaction because you just explained. You no, know no, they'll say, oh, the word, and then that's it. Nah, they won't nah, keep nah, on nah, talking nah, about nah, it. Nah, nah, they, won't nah, ke- nah. they won't keep on talking about it. Like right now, if you told that story to him and then he bumped into me, I'd be like, yo, you have heard Will? Oh, yeah, Will, he's doing, he's doing his thing. But if you would have told him how you got a fight and a beatdown, yo, you've seen Will? Oh, yeah, yo, let me tell you what happened to him. Because it's more fucking. It's more entertaining. It's like, more, well, I would say it's, well, it's, more, it's more entertaining to be mad at someone's good news. And because That's there's a bunch true. of haters. That is That very- too. But I want to add on to that is because of uh if you say, Hey, I have I'm about uh I have my own store, this is how I did it. Right. And you tell that story like I did this, I did that, and then this is how I did it for years, mm-hmm. and this is the small goals that I did. Then that's, I think, in my opinion, that's where it gets interesting to the you story. Get hate, like well, it depends. No, that's what I was just gonna say. Like, like, you might get more hate you than get, anything that's, else. That's, that's what I mean. Some, that's even what I, hate, you're gonna get a copycat. Yeah, not only both. A, probably both. you probably get. That's both. why I copyright. That that's what the copyright no, is no, for. That's why a lot of people, <laughs> yeah. right? You know, matter of fact, there was a video where, you know how they do the split screen video and the person's talking about it? The one guy was telling them how he made it, but he didn't say the whole thing. The girl in the background said, you see, this is the problem with the black people. They don't want to tell you every step they did. Hello? Penalizing. You researched the same way he did. Why would I need to research and bust my ass for 10, 20 years Just to, to try to do. tell you how to do it in 10 minutes? Exactly. I can tell yes. you, you know, hey, this is the book I read. This is the website I went to. I can tell you that. Now you have to read you have to do the rest and look at the website. You know what I'm saying? But they blame people the, don't on do the people. That. They, people don't want to do that. They be like, "Yo, it's here, hard. here, oh, no. oh." But wanna, if, like, let's say me and you, we're, we're both owners. Now I'll tell him, "Yo, these are the steps." Because why? He's already an owner, so I know that he did many, you know, different research. But some guy that just come out of the blue want to do the same thing. Like, wait a minute, no. It's the same thing like stocks, like you know, say like oh, crypto stocks, whatever. Yeah. They'd be like, "Oh, uh, should I hold or sell?" Yeah, and then now, if you're talking, <laughs> and then yo, yo, if you're talking to how big are her titties? <laughs> <It's>, <laughs> right, that's what I'm saying. It's because to be if her titties are big, you can hold them and sell them at the same time. Yep. That's, facts. <laughs> that's facts, and that's called profit. profit. <laughs> It's easy to be mad about some shit you don't understand too. Yeah. No. No. But then like if you, it's something like 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 I, like I said like it's I can hate on that process the fact that like oh I got good news man yeah, fuck yeah. you nigga no no right? no but it, it, it can it, also it, be that, not to cut you off but it also can be that oh look at him bragging like you're gonna tell the whole story about how he did it you know what I'm saying that that's what you're gonna look at it as like you telling your like okay yo I took these steps to get here it's like man you know what fuck you nigga that, that was <laughs> you <laughs> because because that's you, you were too lazy to take the goddamn steps He's that's like, how yo, you can tell I'm not being braggadocious I'm telling you how I got here mm-hmm. so but they they're gonna take it as the other way so it's it's hard right. turn that, like. I got that question from cops, man. Like cops in that fucking live PD. Yeah. Oh man, we really I didn't even go. I didn't. I didn't. Even, I, I didn't even think about like world star and shit like that. Right. I look, I'm like, okay, so it had to start like somewhere. We turned this shit into entertainment. So like, yeah, we even world star just blew it up. More. We even turned jail entertaining. You got like what sixty days in and shit like that. Pretty now? much. So like, like I, I don't know. Society's fucked up. 
They, li- they love drama. We made more. it fucked up. Yeah, we did. Did like, we or did we walk into it? Well, you. Well, uh, a person like me, a person they, like they me, brainwash uh, us. I think they brainwash us more. Into absolutely. Warning. Yes, because that's all they keep putting up is putting up, putting up. That, that when you see a good story, it'd be like ten seconds of the good story, and that's it. Like you don't hear nothing. There's a poster where this guy is selling um this thing that he was like, this is how people are. I got my new name and all this. You see one guy like this. This guy, I failed everything. You see everybody on their side. Yeah, because they love the drama. They love the failure. They love to see you. They I don't want to see you succeed. I don't want to hear good news, nigga. I know, right? Like, well, I, don't have, I don't want to hear how good your cup of coffee was this morning, nigga. All right. I had a good <laughs> cup today. So why? I had a good, especially if you got one of those that had a bad day. For real. I want to hear how you stubbed your toe this morning, nigga. <laughs> <Damn>. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I want to hear about your, your your wife's affair. Like I want to hear about all of that. I want to hear about your wife's affair. Like, other shit. You know your wife is fucking Timmy, like you said earlier. Like I don't want to hear about your wife's affair. I already know about it. I'm with her. No. <laughs> it's like I'm one of them. Damn. Damn. <laughs> the context of things. The contact? Um, I think like, my daughter gets on my fucking nerves with it. Like she'll know automatically the context of what you speak, right? She knows what you mean. But she'll fuck with you and say, you mean this? Oh, I get that every day from my son. So people, like, really seriously do that shit. Because, I mean, that's just me and my daughter fucking around. But people, like, really do that shit in the media. Yeah, all day, every day. You got to be technical. Or what you do is you get them, like, the, the whole thing to do is to get them to say a sound bit that you know will sound fucked up. So it's not mm-hmm. going to be the full phrase. But the, you, get, you are just able to edit out the piece that you need. And you turn it into a story. Very much, and then, and then they, so they, like literally, you'd be like, "I don't like Asian cuisine, right?" I don't and like all Asian. you get out of it is, "I don't like Asians," mm-hmm. and you're like, "Wait, wait, what? Well, that's not what I said. I said I'm not a big fan of noodle." The yeah, fuck like, yo, like, yo, be that's careful fucking, now. You know he was like, <laughs> "I don't, I don't give the sauce to my noodles. I just give them the dry." Yo, the thing about it was, yo. <laughs> Give them the, I take the, the, the spice from that one. Yes, that's what I was about to talk noodles. about. Like, I had to, like, no. listen and listen to that shit. And I'm like, yo. Try me as shit somebody <laughs> could do to somebody. You were talking about, like, the uh, the, the noodles, the flavors, Asian, and then he races. Gives them. I kept hearing, like, all of that shit. And I'm like, <laughs> yeah. I'm like, what? I had to stop smoking for a second and, like, listen. <laughs> like, no bullshit. Like, all right. And again, ladies and gentlemen, these are inside jokes that you guys can hear if you listen to past episodes. Please do. <laughs> But now, nah, like, I had to go back a lot. Like, if you would have to cut that the same way, like, it was like, you racist fuck. <laughs> and then after that, right. you're talking about, like, yo, the noodles are Chinese and they're black noodles. And then we were like, yo, what the fuck oh, is a black noodle? Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. yeah. Yo. But, that whole and, shit. And like he was saying it with the media, let's go back to uh, what he just said. <laughs> if you notice, all the people screaming about the shots. But in the media, in the beginning, they said, this is an experimental vaccine. For-. And now they cut the experimental off. Yep. And now everybody's thinking, it's the cure. This is the cure. No, it's still an experimental. But you see how they just take the word out. But, and- what, but what I don't like what they're doing is they making it seem like, oh, okay, if you take this, you You're get cured. free fries. You get free fries. If you, I like if free you ta- fries. But if you, yeah. ta- if you no. take this, you get free amusement park. You get you, yeah. you get in the Belmont Park. Uh, yes, yeah. come on. That's so what I don't like. When, when, when they do that, you grab the, va- the vaccine and you go. They didn't say you had to get the shot. They said you take it. So I'm taking it with me to get my free fries. <laughs> you know so what? you're taking that vaccination card right. for, your free- for my free card. <laughs> I didn't say I was going to get the shot. Remember what I told her last time. <laughs> You got people walking around with the vaccine in their book bags. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, you might can, like, pull some is shit. Is it the vaccine, or do they just tell you it's the vaccine? It, it, could, it, could, it could be just water. Water. I was about to say the same thing. You know what I'm saying? I said a placebo. Yeah. yeah. Oh, same thing. It could be but, sugar water. I, I, water I, could be sugar water. You don't know. Sugar. Yeah, but, you know, how they took that, they start using the experimental one, the first sentence. Yep. So now everybody was like, no, it's the cure. Who said that? Well, That's what they said. Take the shot. No, it's still an experimental shot. If you was going to let that fucking Johnson & Johnson shock it, uh, shot. Nah, support black business. Listen, stay, <laughs> stay with the lotion and the, and the powder. <laughs> Yo. You know? Look, at, look 
his face though. Because you know how many incidents that fucking Johnson and Johnson yeah, had over the fucking real. years, nigga. Like the poison yeah. is uh fucking. They had to turn town on the fucking capsules because the fucking. Uh, Listen, you are taking a shot from a um, from a company that had been doing powder for a long time that they had to recall the powder for a couple years. That's facts. So come on, talk about it. So when I seen that, I was, I'm like, and then they talk about like, oh, we, the, there's blood clots yeah. going on, and the one that wasn't named took had moth in it. Listen. I ain't bullshitting. It had, anyway, um, it had things of a, of a um. It sounds like a fucking thing. It sounds like I'm joking, right? But it had um some some sort of uh, moth 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 uh thing in it. The, the one from Regeneron. Right? You can go look it up. No, he had um it had stem cells from a dead fetus. Is what was in it. So it had yeah, for the cells. ones that took the shot. <laughs> Well, I mean, it's from like 1969. Mm-hmm. So it had like the stem cells from that aborted fetus back in 1969. Yeah, just watch the words. In, in that vaccine, in the one that Trump took in particular, the Regeneron vaccine, or the cocktail, Regeneron cocktail. And what the media does too, they, they change the word that means exactly that. But since they use a big word, you don't research it. Pretty much. You know what I'm saying? And that's where it all gets confusing. Much. Oh, because of aliens in the news. <laughs> what are you personally going to do if you find out that aliens exist? I'm going to be like, yo, why run. you I'm, I'm going to be like, why you didn't show yourself the first time? Fat. Oh, run. And then run. Run. <laughs> or run, Forrest, run. You, boy. Uh, no, but you see, what again. You call me? Called you again, boy, boy. Why he did, why he yeah. just said. Was oh, run. Yeah, just tuck up. What? And bleed out. <laughs> Look, I, got, I got something for you. He just said, run when you see an alien. Why? Because MS-13 is dangerous. But. <laughs> you can't do that anymore. <laughs> Yo. Yo, I was eating a bag. I don't know how to like. I don't know where to go with that, man. Yo. Yo. Yo, I I'm think sick. I killed Charles. Lucky, <laughs> yo, no lie, Lucky. I, I already chewed the candy. It was just a little bit got stuck Ooh. right on my throat. I'm not, I don't even Holy know shit! Like that that that's messed up. <laughs> that was cold. That was prejudice, sir. You shouldn't be saying those things. <laughs> no, but in other words, we never seen an alien. We don't know how they act. So. We see so much movies and so much thing. We think that they're just gonna come and shoot us. We're gonna run. Cause it's funny we ask questions fuck. later. You know, as we run it. It's know? funny as a motherfucker. Like before that shit was like everybody was like all oh, for it, right? <laughs> oh, hey. <laughs> Your child's really dying. Yo, like, come on, child. You need a you need a hat in the back, child. But now, like like before, like it was like like you know you hear about the shit, but now you seeing the fucking videos with aliens popping up for real. Everybody quiet. What are you talking about? On YouTube. No. What? That's not a thing. Yes, it is. No, we're not. Who? Shut up before they shut us down. Oh. <laughs> yo, I can't, yo. I can't. Hamburger, oh. titties, orange juice, and collard greens. What was we talking about? I don't know, but you said titties. Yeah. <laughs> What's your favorite that's uh, your... Bra, uh, bra size? Isn't that your favorite? Whatever fits in my mouth and then some. Yes. Whoa, 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 wait. wait. What like did I just walk into? <laughs> Some titties, nigga. Like, what oh, because I, mean? I was like, whatever I can fit I in like my mouth the and then some. Yeah, I was like, wait go. a minute. Do I got to go. go back out and come back in? Come on back in. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you never man. know on XY 101 what we're talking about here. All types of titties. Oh. Yeah. Titties. About too crisp. Like, it, 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 From M&M's to... Because <laughs> I call them the M&M's, the ones that melt in your mouth. Oh, I like that. <laughs> <laughs> and the one question that I was going to save for a thing, but I'll, oh, I'll God, ask it here, I, too. Still the... Oh, no. Actually, is there any better way that they could market fucking birth control? You want baby? No. Take this. No. I told, him, I told my wife. No, no. Film all the kids in the Bronx in the playground. You ain't going to want no kids. <laughs> that's it. I told my wife. I was, I was like, you need right? to put I, a fucking scream in the kid. How, how do you... Uh... How do you uh, market birth control better? I said, take them to the Bronx, to the playground. You ain't going to want none of these kids. There you go. <laughs> you yeah, see these brat yeah. ass kids you want, you're talking you wanna, about? You wanna market Baby, you better wrap control. it up. Yeah. Give everyone a video Body of condoms? a bunch of children wrapped up in a net <laughs> and said, this is effective. 
That's it. Or now you go to old, you go to old school. You go to old school. <laughs> this is your life. This is your life with these bratty ass kids. <laughs> <laughs> Any questions? Blatant with it. Yeah, like, you got to be like real, real blatant with it, I guess. Yeah, well, that's what I said. Yeah. The Take them to Chuck E. Cheese in the Bronx. Kind of like scared of, straight or something like that. There are a lot of people who want kids and don't actually think about how hard it's going to be. Yeah. That, that. So if you show them the stress, it'll slow them down a bit. They'll, they'll wait until they're actually either mature enough or financially stable enough to do it rather yeah. than act reckless while they're young. That's all it is. If you really want, if you really want effective birth control, do exactly what Dave Chappelle said. Get the two oldest teachers in the school. Put them, you know, smothered up in mayonnaise and have them fuck each other. So they hear every sound. Oh, my God. Ain't nobody going to fuck after that. The thing about it is, <laughs> I, I, on if, that. You, if you're hearing every sound, I don't know. You no. probably be no. What? Yo, you hear this shit? No, 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 no. no. We're not talking about, oh, put, like, make it happen. No, no. You hold the whole school, put them into the assembly hall, uh. and have the two of them on stage, smothering themselves their naked old ass bodies and man names, and, what and makes, then start to fuck each other. What makes and that? no child in that school is going to want to repeat that act. It's like what, what makes you not want to have sex after you think about the fact your parents had to do it to make you. You what? at least slow up for 24 hours. <laughs> well, some of them probably, that's when the pervertedness of come, some of them come out. They'd be like, oh, shit, this is really turning me on. What Bring makes the tartar sauce, right too. There, <laughs> those, those are the ones that, are, that can never be stopped. Yeah. If you look, like, I only seen while I was bloat, but when you look at the guy while they're sitting on top of each other, that dude's feet, like, arch up, like he's, like, really being pleasured. If you go back and look at it. What, a photo you put? On the, on the Chappelle show clip, oh, when, right, when he put the mayonnaise on and shit, yep. it's like, <laughs> his feet do this right here. As no, see, that just, just don't, when you I'm look at an image like that, you just don't want to have sex at all. Yeah. Yep. Right. Know, forget the kids. Yeah, that nasty <laughs> smile on his face and all yep. that. No, but, you know, kids are blessings if you have kids. We're just saying. Kind of this sure. is calm OD. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Calm OD, yes. Right. Calm OD, yes. I'm not gonna say Saying it like you're a Chinese person just learning English, huh? No, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> nah, Chinese guy in the restaurant in the Bronx, I don't know. Kamoti, kamoti, kamoti. Kamoti. Gonna say very funny, man. Very, very funny. funny, very funny. <laughs> <laughs> Why when they say that, they, I feel like I, I'm, I need to get in my stance, well, real, right? Though. When they be like, "You very good man," I'm like, "Whoa, what? What? Nigga, what, what? <laughs> you you want fight?" Oh, very good comedy, ah! Like they being sarcastic, like oh, oh, I, I don't got to come back really. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> they, they stop you right there. <laughs> you very, you. very, very funny, funny man. man. Ah. Know, yeah. <laughs> you think you have the jokes? <laughs> yeah. When they do the double very, very, very funny. Oh, you got your boys coming. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> the call? Yeah, very, very funny. I have very, very big gun too, cuckoo. My nigga. Yeah, like right, cuckoo. That's it. Fuck that cuckoo. <laughs> <laughs> what? Cuckoo, all you want to? God damn it. So was it that's what? Oh, oh uh, when your handwriting might as well be chicken scratch. Huh? Yeah. How soon is too soon? Are they worth the risk? Why are you so blind? Dude. Wait, 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 wait. I am high as a motherfucker. That is true. This man does nothing but blaze all day. I do not, man. Oh, the spo- oh, sorry. Um, exposure videos. Anybody watch exposure videos? Exposure videos? I mean, I remember... You took it too long. You took it too long. I had to throw I, a little beep in I there. I remember exposing smuts back in the day. <laughs> huh? So the on, exposure videos? So yeah, on, yeah, yeah, On Facebook, they had a whole... There was a group that was called Exposing Smuts, right? If you were a guy whose girl cheated on him... Yeah. You would throw their picture up. If you were... If you, if you had a town... Like, if your town had a town slut... Everybody had a piece or whatever. Yo, they would throw the picture of them. You would, they would throw the picture. They I drop. remember. I remember the, the cheating one. No, no, no. This I remember was, that. This, no. was for, this was for high school. High right? school. And yeah, they, I remember they, that. They would throw up their, yes. their social media pages, so you can hit them up on Facebook. You hit them up on, on Instagram. They call them up. pops. Right. Pops, the thing was Facebook. popcorn. Facebook. My days, we just put them in the bathroom. No. We put them on, on no, the wall. Facts. We just write no, them on the wall. Facebook used to shut, like, the, the group existed for about six MySpace. months. MySpace, MySpace. they tried to shut them down, and, yeah. and they kept making more groups. They That's where I see it. MySpace. That's so, where I seen it at, MySpace. Exposing yes. smuts was legit, bro. Yeah, but there was some people that was like, cheaters. I didn't cheat on you. We were on break. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so, nah, 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 nah. No. Fuck that. If you, and I mean, when they posted up your picture, it was a nude. Everybody saw your titties on pussy. Like, this, that's just how the <laughs> shit works. Ew, man. Nah, Matt niggas got laid off of that. It was a beautiful I, I thing. Know. It's, 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 <laughs> like, they would literally be like, hey, like yo, yo, you could have put a, good, a better one on? She cheated on me that's with something. It was cold that day. 
Niggas were carrying weed on them all day. Like, that's sort of shit. Like, nah, see? And they put a bad one. I'd be like, listen, you got to explain. It was cold that day. That pitch is no good. <laughs> do, it, do it to me like, yo, good pussy, shitty head. Or good head, shitty pussy. Like, oh, yo, damn. Th- it was the best. It was my favorite part of Facebook back in the day. Because there was always updates from 10 until 4 in the morning. Jesus Christ. Because I'm like, yo, that shit. It was pictures you- from back to back. That like pictures back to back on my space. The shit I see was like get you, get you killed. Like you, like okay. So what I mean is like you seen to catch a predator before. The predator to catch a predator. Yeah. You seen it before yet? Yeah? Oh, the show. Oh, yeah. You seen the show before, right? So the reason that show ended eventually, it, the the, fir- the, the, the first fact one, that it was a calling trapment. But go ahead. But you know, that we're, too, we're, no, we're no, got, that, that that too. Yeah. That too. But the guy killed himself. Uh, Texas senator or something. The, the, the host. No, no. no. Oh, no. oh, oh, one of the guys that they exposed. Yeah. And so now you got these, these predator watch groups and shit like that online. So why do we find that shit so fucking entertaining too? And is it worth the fucking risk? Well, I like it because, because they, we got some of the people we out. Because then we find out who the fuck is dangerous. The, the thing about it is, like, that nigga got pumped. <laughs> mm-hmm. Because it's the best of both worlds. Because they were like, seen he's that, gone. That, that one video, one guy got exposed, but in the midst of getting exposed, the other group got exposed also. Ouch. Yeah. That, ain't that what happens, though? Like, you get busted, and then you're like, oh, so I, I this guess, is tied with this, and this is tied with that. Now that I think about it, I guess, I guess so, because fucking Chris Hansen ended up getting into some shit because of right, right. exposing mm-hmm. people. But exposing, if you did... Like, back in the days, there was a show called Beretta. I know I'm showing my age. Oh, Beretta. But it said, no, don't do the crime if you can't do the time. Well, then if you won't want to do it. you know what? That that's nigga your problem. in jail for life right now. Yeah. Who? Beretta. Beretta, yeah, because he did, <laughs> he did the crime, and now he's going to do the time. That nigga's in jail right now. But they, they've been exposed, like, uh, no, matter of fact, the woman started doing it with broke di- um, baby daddies. <laughs> exposing them because they didn't want to pay child support and stuff like that. I heard pretty dick. much. I heard broke dick. Nah, I, I broke see. date. Broke dick. Broke, broke daddies. Dick. He said broke. two words. Bro. You 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 know we're not talking about these porn sites you'd be looking up. We're talking about broke dick. What what, that, <laughs> what what kind of porn shit is this? <laughs> well, you know there actually is handy. Wait, 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 wait. Wait. If I, if I, <laughs> You know what? If I put that down, they probably going to pop up. No, no, no. There is handicap porn. Oh, a handicap? No, no. They, they, they are people, normally for people who are missing like a leg yeah. or an arm or something. There's something for so anybody. I'm with a nigga who has like a I never dick. saw that before. Handicap or yeah. I never saw that so, before. So from the 70s to 80s, there's a really weird age where they explored all things in porn. So like there's muscle women who like straight up are bodybuilders. Right, yeah, right. right. There's, there's somebody porn, for anybody. There's, there's um, hairy porn. There's a whole bunch. And in that time, there was a large thing with um, handicap porn. Talking about, can you feel this shit? Huh? No? Oh, damn. It's going to make me work. Let me take <laughs> Jumpy yeah, Jackson exactly. shit. I'm going to work on this. Yeah. <laughs> and it's, most, it's mostly people who are like amputees. Ah. They be like, listen, she might not got legs, but you seen the ass on that girl? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yo. that's another army reference. They call you broke dicks if you can't fucking do the exercises, motherfucker. So oh, I, uh, thought, uh. I thought that that's what he was getting at when he said broke <laughs> dick. I thought I heard broke dick, and then it, he was like, "What?" So, <laughs> on that note, this has been another episode of X Y One O One. I'm your host, Calvin. Peace. 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 Peace.